Okay, for the next step, we are going to attempt to access the panel underneath to change the air filter. So what you want to have ready is the screws that you're going to need to undo here on the bottom to get at the air filter. Um, and you're going to want a new air filter, obviously. Right here, and I prefer to do uh, work with OEM. This is from FCP Euro because then it's the right fit and we don't mess it up. A 10 millimeter uh, socket and to remove two 10 millimeter bolts underneath. You might want to move the seat back for more space to work for, with. One, two. The second step is to gently pry off this trim part. Oh. Before pulling it out completely though, you want to loosen the 12, the 12 volt uh, connector over here and the footwell lamp. Okay, not as easy as it looks. You gotta wiggle it out. And I think the footwell lamp actually is right here. Um, you can unplug that or not. I'm going to unplug it. Uh, just because I'm mean, gonna when I take this piece out, I'm gonna give it a nice clean. So I'm just gonna put that aside. Which you can access at a very awkward angle and loosen them like that. Okay, here we go. One. And if your back didn't hurt before, it's going to now. So then you're going to pull it down like this, gently, 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 and I can already see there's quite a bit of crud on it. I don't think this filter's ever been changed. This will go down to the side like that, and you can see that the person who had this car stored it under pine leaves because they're all pine leaves. We're just going to pull it down. Okay. Okay. And we're going to look at it carefully. You see it has a little BMW and an arrow pointing that way. And it actually doesn't look so bad, but it does look quite dirty. So you can see there's some crud down there. And we're going to clean out in there before we put the new filter in. So, it's not so bad actually. I'm not finding a lot of dust in there. But maybe the filter is just old and that's why it doesn't smell good. But here we have the official filter. So, you see the same company. And we're going to reinstall the same way we took it out. With the arrow going that way. Okay, after checking for uh, more pine needles and debris in there, we are going to place the filter with the arrow towards the front of the car. We'll disturb this water drain tube. That's for any water that gets into the system to, as you can see, has channels where it can run off uh, out of the get car. Get on your hands and knees, and you're going to get the uh, end of it in first. And then you're gonna push the air filter in like that. Before attempting to, it's gonna fit in there pretty snugly. It's not gonna fall back out. So you don't have to worry about that. It's got a plastic guide over here for it to slide it and it just 
pops into place very easily. Strip these because obviously they're supposed to change this every... You can see the plastic kind of pushing in. So that's it, it just bottoms out, no need to twist it harder. Very lightly. Again, you can see the plastic being pressed up and the gasket being squeezed. As soon as it's in place, that's it. There's really not much more to twist. The gasket, the rubber gasket seals that in. Check that the drain hose isn't kinked and is in good order. I'm just checking mine right now. Okay, check that this is secure. We're going to reinstall the rubber piece. Uh, the, not the rubber piece, but the plastic trim. We're going to click the connector light in, make sure it's secure. Okay, plug the 12 volt socket that some of you probably doesn't don't even know exists back in. <laughs> Piece in, then the right, and then you will click all of them in like that. And you are all set. Sorry about that, uh, but basically you line up all the clips here and you click them in. As I was recording, it told me it was a low battery. So, and then make sure it's okay back there, like that. And once you've clicked this in, you're done. And now we can run the fan and see if the air is all good and fresh. So let's try to do that now. The engine's on. Let's turn the fan up. And it smells nice and fresh. And we got a little tire, so we're gonna inflate that. Uh, if you found that useful, thank you for watching. Please rate and subscribe and leave comments on how I can improve my work. So thank you very much for watching.